So there's the look at the winch cable and the hook. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the hook off. That way you can get a better look at it and compare it to the stock hook. Um, so first things first, we're gonna turn the winch on. Come over here. Find the remote. There it is. This is the wireless remote that comes with the Smitty belt. It also has a plug-in for the wire that attaches up here to here. But I like using the wireless. So you got wired and wireless. Now it's on, we're gonna winch it out. Just a little bit, that way I can go ahead and unhook the hook. So in order to take the hook off the line, all you really need is maybe some pliers, maybe even not even that since it's new, you just need your fingers. So I'm gonna be using my fingers, but if you wanted to, you could use the pliers, put it on and off. You get the cotter pin. Push up. There it is. Place that there, pop that out. There you have it. Put them side by side. Move the wire out the way. Unhook the hook. Okay, so on the right hand side, we have the stock hook, which is half inch forged still and then on the left side we have the 3 8 hook that I bought off of Amazon for about $35-$40 uh, it's a smaller pin compared to the stock pin so there's a huge difference this hook is rated for 35,000 pounds which is its breaking point uh, I'm pretty sure this hook is rated for more. I don't really know the specs on this hook, but just based off the size, the thickness, this hook would probably be the better option to leave on the trailer. I put this hook on to go ahead and see if it could do the job. Um, I, in a way, I did like that it was kind of smaller because it felt like it was more easy to handle, but I'd rather have this big hook just for safety precautions that way, if I ever pick up a heavy load, I know I have a hook that is big enough to handle the load rather than this hook where I'd have to question would this hook be able to pick up a heavy, heavy dumpster? I really don't know. And uh, there's another guy on YouTube. Uh, I think he's American AF Dumpster Rentals. Uh, I believe he has this hook, but in red. Uh, I'm not sure if it's a 3 8 hook or if he uh, purchased a half inch hook. I'm not sure if they even sell the bigger size. I'm really not sure. I might have just ended up buying the smaller hook and not even known it. But um, I believe I clicked the link that he had on his video and I went ahead and bought it because I thought it was pretty cool that it was, you know, lime green. But I mean, you could go ahead and buy you, a, you know, a, a paint can and paint this any color you want. So I'll probably end up doing that. To be honest, I really bought this one because it looked cool. But now that I've used it, now that I've compared it to the stock, you know, hook, um, I would stay with the stock hook if I were you. I wouldn't go out and buy this and waste your money on this uh, because uh, it's a smaller hook. And who knows, this thing may break. I mean, it's, it's pretty tiny compared to the stock hook. So uh, there's a quick overview on that. Um, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, click the notifications. I'm going to be doing a review on some other items uh, here pretty soon. But anyways, my name is Fabian with Chunk Express. Uh, I'm going to be making these videos about my roll-off business. Uh, I already have a uh, growing junk removal business. I'm getting into the roll-off dumpsters. I just purchased three dumpsters, a, a PJ Rolster, and I bought a few upgrades and things. And of course, I went on YouTube. And there was a lot of videos that did not explain or show things that I would like uh, to go ahead and make and, uh, and explain to you guys. So I'll be making these videos about reviews of some of the items that I've purchased. 
uh, my experience with the dumpster, my experience with the roll-off, uh, and everything like that. So if you like these videos, please like, subscribe, uh, and tap the notification button if you want to go ahead and see, you know, some of my newest videos that I'm going to be posting. I'm going to be posting more about the dumpsters, more about the, the business side of things, and everything like that. So I guess uh, let's go ahead and dive in, and I'll go ahead and show you the hook. Alright, so there you have it. I'm going to go ahead and put the stock hook back onto the winch. Um, the green hook looked nice, but again, I don't feel comfortable putting a smaller hook uh, on something that, I mean, could end up becoming 10,000, 12,000 pounds. Uh, so we're going to stay with the stock.